Hello and welcome back to another episode of Uru Complete Chronicles, where we are back in our... Ah, man. <laughs> What's this card again? Where are my notes? Why am I never prepared for these? This is called my Relto, I think. Um, last episode, we managed to get the first of these pillars from... I don't know where from, actually. Yeah, I don't know how all of this works and what all of this is called. And even though I, I said I would, you know, proceed to only record when I had time for multiple episodes, I've not really been able to do that because I don't know. Yeah. Ah, I'm way behind schedule wise. Um, like the only thing I have a little backlog of is Calamity Canyon, and even that, it's not a huge backlog, so. I'm, I'm struggling for some reason. This is not a good month for me. I don't know. Nothing's nothing's working out right. Um, so I'm way behind on everything. And there are so many things I should be working on and recording and I should stream and I should do so many things. And I just, I don't get anything done. It's terrible. But we've completed Teladan for the most part. There's one page thing there we're gonna get, uh, which I don't know how that works or what it does, but I want to do it anyway. And I wanted to see if we could get the veil uh, thing shroomy, I think. Maybe. I'm not sure now. To swim into the bay there. So I, I, let's just start there. Also, apparently we started with the second one. I think. Because, well, I mean, we figured that when we saw this bookshelf here, which clearly shows that we have the second book and not the first one. Uh, but I thought we checked that. I guess I made a mistake or maybe the information wasn't quite accurate. We found within the book, whatever. We'll go back to Teladan and we'll do those, those two things or however many things <laughs> we have to do. Oh, I wanna know if I can actually get back there now. Because we didn't really leave and there's no new path. Yeah, this is interesting. We'll see. Once again, I'm completely unable to walk down this stupid ladder. <laughs> the controllers are so awkward. I don't know why. I mean, I remember games. Okay, I can't walk backwards, I guess that's the key. I have to walk forward so I can turn around and then climb down, you know, facing the other way, which, whatever. I remember playing games, when, when did this come out? 2005 or something? I, I remember playing games at that time, <laughs> so. And I don't remember controllers being this weird. I, I do remember a few games with weird controllers, so. Actually, one of my favorite RPGs ever has really awkward, especially combat controllers, and that's uh, Gothic. And Gothic 2. Those are really good games. I don't know if they were as good in English as they were in German, because they were German or are German games. But those, those two games were amazing. I don't know why I'm talking about them now, but... That's how it goes sometimes. And they made a third gothic, which was not very good on release. Uh, so I skipped it and then I played it when it got like a community patch. That was a really weird. I've never seen anything like that happen again, I think. At least I can't recall. Uh, they, they basically, there was a, a group of modders and they like, they signed an NDA and stuff, I think. And they got to um, patch the game. So they made like a, a community patch for Gothic 3 to make it playable, basically. <laughs> Fixed a lot of things. But yeah, they got access to the source code. It's, that's why they had to sign the NDA and stuff. It was really... Yeah, they opened up the source code for some people, which I don't recall that ever happening anywhere else. So what did I do? Is this... Uh, <laughs> I 
Uh, did I invert it? Is that what I did? Do I need to invert them R now? I don't remember doing that. Or is it just the way it was? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, that's going to be slightly annoying here. All right, so we have four. We have that one down, right? Yes. And four is one, two, three, four. It's this. Mm, not sure. Down, up, down, up, down, up, up. I don't remember. I remember only changing this one, the first one, which would be, wait, four, seven, one on this side, actually, this one. But I think I just inverted them all or something. I don't, I don't know that I did. Like I know, I think I did that, but I don't think it was the last thing I did. I thought I put it back the way it was. This is so bad. I'll just invert them all and hope that's it. <laughs> Might be a bad decision. I should really just look at things. Wait, this just seems completely wrong. Come on. <laughs> Nothing seems right here now. I'm very confused. So I don't expect this to open now. Of course not. <laughs> so which way around was it again? It was the... It was... Weird is what it was. But which... <sighs> like my notes say it's down, up, down, up, down, up, up. Which I think this is the in inverted version of, right? Yeah, I hate it. <laughs> so this, okay, we're at two. Two is supposed to be whatever this is, down or up. Ah, I don't know which way it was. I think it was the, not the way I thought it was. So this is up, but up is actually on. And this is off. See, so we want this one off. The next one is six which is also off. And then there's three, which is on. Off, off, on, that seems right. And maybe it should have opened, I'm confused now. <laughs> uh, five, one, two, three, four, five is on. Wait, this is supposed to be on? It is, okay, so that's, I guess that was off. Maybe the bone was just laying close to it. I guess that makes sense. Fair enough. Run through here. It still feels like... Where was that secret? Oh, in the next room, right? Which maybe it's not even a secret, whatever. This texture right here. It looks so much like a door. Who knows? Who knows? Ah, oh, man. All right. Completely sidetracked now. What was I talking about? Oh, yeah, Gothic. <laughs> Not that that was really, you know, relevant, but it's my video. I can talk about whatever I want. Um, <laughs> so we'll just stick with that. Gothic 3. Uh, so I played that a while after release. Like, I bought it for, like, five bucks or something, and then... Um, with the community patch, it was actually a decent experience. Uh, you can see a lot of potential, but they, they just didn't finish it, really. Uh, there was lots of discussion who's to blame, developer or publisher. I guess there was some deadline stuff that just, I don't know, caused some, some problems. Um, and then after, after Gothic, they, they parted ways with their publisher. 
which was actually an Austrian publisher at the time, uh, Chobud, which they don't exist anymore. They're now Nordic Games, I think. I think they got bought out. And they kept the, like, the rights to Gothic, I think. So they had to come up with a new IP, the developers. Where are we? There's a thing here. We're in a new place, I guess. Almost fell in that whore. <laughs> okay, I can't see any two people first person here. This thing again, or well, it's a different thing. So did that, like our book is blinking now. Does it mean it added another page? It did add another page. What does it mean? I don't know what these symbols mean. This looks almost like a face. <laughs> Those are the eyes, it's the mouth, and then there's like, I don't know, weird lines. <laughs> I mean, it's like, there, those are clouds, uh, but there's a cloud down here, which maybe this is like a floating thing. It almost looks like uh, maybe river, a river or three rivers coming down a mountain and then going into three different like lakes or ponds or whatever. And then there's three, three peaks in the mountain range. I don't know. I don't know what that means yet. I don't think we have any information on that, or if we do, I missed it. So is there no way back out of here? And where's, where does this go? Maybe there's a, in the bookshelf, there's an extra slot to the left. Like we are on book number two, there's an open slot to the left, and then there's like a separate section, one further to the left, uh, with room for one book. Maybe this is that area? Who knows? Can we go down here? We can. Uh, we're moving. rotating I don't know where we are I this doesn't look like Teletan at all so I'm assuming we're in a different age because there's like trees and stuff no mushrooms and no beard you know whatever what, what are they called the, the flappers or whatever or there's a green marking and we had orange marking stones lights whatever in until then three ways to go this looks like a dead end let's check it out i want to look up all right yeah we can't do anything here well i don't think so at least interesting i don't know yeah, definitely rotating. Um, I'm not sure if I have an exit here. I guess maybe I do. Uh, way up at least. I'm not sure if I'm done exploring down here, but let's go up, I guess. Feels like the, the right thing to do right now. This is a big structure. I guess we go third person again, just because it makes it easier to see things. I don't know. I feel like the FOV is just better like this. It's just bad in like small rooms. This looks like buttons, but I guess it's not because we can't interact. Is this a door? And it looks like a door. It doesn't have to be one, <laughs> but I, I think it's one. Can we open these like manhole cover things? No. Okay. Where are we going? Nowhere, it looks like. Unless there's a way up somewhere. I think we have to go back down because we can't open that. Yeah. Unless I missed something, which is very possible. But not very likely. So this one is removed, but there's also this weird, like, fence area thing here very strange not sure where we are or if we have a way of figuring out 
that. So I guess we go back down and just finish running around on there. I don't expect to find anything. But you know, we're here, so we were taking a look. And then after we're done with that, I guess we'll take our book back to our uh, relto and then I don't know what it'll do. Something, I'm sure. I think we're just gonna pop out back at that intersection. Was a blinking light? You're not seeing that yet, have we? This is also broken here. I want to look down, not up. Oh, but this is, I think, where we started. I don't remember this light blinking though. Is this where we started? Are these iron bars? Or metal at least. Who knows if it's iron? I don't know. I think this is where we started. I don't think there's a point in running out to these because they are just the same, I assume. Wait. Some bones in there. Is that good? <laughs> that does not seem like a good sign. But yeah, I think there's nothing here. But you can't you can't climb back up. I think. Where we drop down. And that was like a tiny room anyway. I don't think there was anything else there. This looks like a, like a weird sewer thing, but why? More bones. Hmm. What's this? Just a tree? Just a tree. Maybe just something we can see looking out the window, but I um I don't know. I don't think I care right now. I'm assuming we're coming back here later, cause yeah, this doesn't seem like we've done everything here. <laughs> not not by a long shot. All right, so I guess we link back to. Also, can we like okay. If I turn on this, okay, I can have them both lit up. I don't know what it means, but I can. <laughs> but I can. So what I was thinking, no, okay, so that's this then. I thought it was going to be this book, but it's this book. If that wasn't here, right? Pretty sure that's new here. And is this one of those books then? No, it's a different one. I'm confused by that. <laughs> Believe it or not. We had, yeah, this is new. Is this just going to take me back to that room? Yes. That is interesting. But also... Confusing. Maybe there are seven different rooms like this that we have to teleport to to get all the things or the hands. I don't know. I don't think it makes any sense to be here. So we go back again. I don't know. I really don't. We should pick the next book though. Um, 
and not from here, from out there. But which which book was it that we checked? I don't think it was this one. Three? No, one. I mean, <laughs> it looks like a three. <laughs> it's not. No, which book was it with the symbols? Is it this one? Yeah, okay. So one has the mushrooms. So it was actually the first one, because the other one wasn't actually one of those out there. The one that comes before it. Alright, so we didn't make a mistake. Tell then, alright. And then that's two, I think. <laughs> Is it two? No, it's three. But it's page three, like, right? Like two was the, the page beforehand. Yeah, this is page two. This is page three. So the next book we should pick has the the eye and the three mountains with the weird crown on top. And it is called Garrison. <laughs> I don't know. Garrison. Yeah, I don't know. The laws contrived by the proud are the security and their undoing. Such laws make disobedience uh, virtue and obedience a sin. Okay, so we're going to give reason. <laughs> and it's an eye on the free peaked mountain range with some crown thing on top. Let's see. Is it you? It is not you. Or you? Uh, is it you then? Nope. Wait, where did I see? I'm confusing myself here, I guess. <laughs> I thought it was in the back, but maybe not. There it is. Okay, we missed it. It is on the back. This is the right one. I think. And we'll do the veil thing later, maybe. Because I, I don't want to go back there now. I mean, I kind of do. But at the same time, I don't. Okay. Weird. Roofless, ceilingless area. Weird room. very it almost looks like a dwarven area to me like the stone stuff very I don't know like not plain but not super detailed ornaments or anything just very pragmatic in a way I guess Oh, and this is already like a visitor area thing. Right, so this one was open for for visitors, apparently. The DRC reminds us to please retrieve our KI. Which was what again? <laughs> uh, I forget. <laughs> it's terrible. Hello? Can we open this door? No. Past these cones, is there anything we can do? Does not look like it. Alright, and we have to keep an eye out again for hands and stuff. To remind myself of that. Which always means you should turn around and you walk through doors. And we should always go where we're not supposed to. That's just the general rule of thumb, I think. Who is yeah. to live your life by? Go where you're not supposed to. <laughs> Maybe not. Don't take advice from me. What, what do I know? Okay. One of these again. Don't know what they mean. Oh, we can move this one. I thought they were fixed the ground I guess not oh there's one of those again do you want to take it now I guess it doesn't hurt because we have not made any progress here 
So this looks like, yeah, this is the reception area. The other side of that. The employee would be to talk to visitors, customers, whatever. Oh, come on, look down at this thing. What is this? Almost looks like a, a helmet of sorts. And... Oh, the, like the, the lights are supposed to be on top of these things? Interesting. But yeah, I guess we'll take this right now. Let's see where it takes us. If it takes us back to that place we just left. The rotating thing. Nope, that looks like a different place altogether. Alright, let's just look at the view first. Very nice view. Uh, yeah. Oh, it's not, I don't have my Steam OLED. What's the screenshot button again? Who remembers? A 5? I have no idea. I have to check. Uh, a five. I guess maybe I take take a picture there. <laughs> I don't. It doesn't tell me if I did. I keep forgetting there's like a strafe left and right button. I'll be used for occasionally at least. A five. There you go. I keep thinking I see movement, but it's just the, the texture or the lighting of the stairs down there. That changes when I move. So I think I can't le leave this place. So this is like a, another viewing area thing, just like in Teladan, down at the, at the pump thing. I don't know what I'm looking at here. These look like humanoid creatures. And they have... those look like the pillars actually, and this looks like my Relto, in a way. I don't know what this means, almost looks like a, a rainbow, or something shooting out of the pillars or something, not sure. Then we have four of those pillar things in uh, like a mushroom, and then the same here. Not sure what this means. An eye, some more creatures. It looks very interesting. It probably is good information to have, but yeah. I wonder if this is Gehisen? <laughs> I already forgot the name again. It doesn't look like it to me. It looks like a different place. But then again, we haven't seen much of that yet. So did I? Oh no, I didn't get a Simber. Right, because there's no page here. Right. And there is no page here, right? No. So there's a no hand thing to be found. Alright. I guess we just head back. I don't know what these, like, I don't know what they mean, I don't know what they do. And we didn't get a book here. Shouldn't we have a book here now? Wait, what? Uh, that's no good. Because that's the Teladan book, right? Yeah. So I can't. Oh, wait. No, that's the viewing point. Right. I'm confused. 
Wait, is this the cohesion book then? I just didn't use it right? But it was still out there, I'm confused. No, it is though. Oh, that is also there, that cell. What? <laughs> and what's, where does this take me? This took me to that cell room. Where does it take me here? I need to learn things here. I need to figure some things out, I think. takes me to the last hand thing, the last rem remnant I found. Oh, it's like a checkpoint system. That makes sense. <laughs> All right. <laughs> ah, good, I guess. So we don't have to start from the start. That's good. That would have been a nice shortcut. Wait, I can take this? What was that? Where did I go? Oh, it was for some clothing. We might want to change into that. <laughs> Back in our rail too. Uh, wait, so where does this go again? This go. I'm so lost. Oh, this is a secret door down here. Right, right, right. And then we can go through the upstairs thing. It does sound like the machine is off, actually. But no, I, I wouldn't hear it from here, right? Can I move this one? No, see, this one is not mover. It's like stuck in the ground and flashing orange. Very strange. Actually, not that strange at all. So the gate is down, right? Yes. Can we actually run back this way? I think I can jump that, right? Yeah, it's a one-way thing. Now if you shut this off, we'll get a visitor from, from from the ocean here, from the open sea. I really hope so, but I'm not. I'm not confident <laughs> that it will actually happen. I'm not sure if it will happen right away. Maybe not. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't look good. Ah, I really wanted to see Shroomy. I think Shroomy is that right? I really I should have checked. After not being able to remember the name before. Somehow it sounds wrong. But what that tells me is that we could, if we had done Gehisen first, or whatever it's called, we could not have finished it without being here, because we need to be here to teleport into that room with the last cloth thing. So it makes sense that this was first, in a way. So I was, we would have been stuck in the other age trying to figure out where that last cloth is. Either way, I guess no visitors for us here, which would have been nice, but it's fine. Maybe another time. It looks like there's more like movement there, but I, I think I'm just that's just visual thinking. So instead, we're gonna head back to our rail tour. Uh, actually, oh, am I? Did I actually put on that thing? I did put on that shirt. 
<laughs> I did not notice that. That is an amazing shirt. What is all of that? That is crazy looking. I wonder who left that there. Let's check it out in the wardrobe. Go back to Narnia and stuff. Maybe take off our, our gases. <laughs> this looks crazy. Does it have a name? Tie dye t-shirt, okay. Oh, we can change the, tie, the, the dye. Make it even worse. Oh, that's good. <laughs> I like that. Oh, it looks horrible. <laughs> I enjoy that. Okay, uh, maybe some shorts of that. Oh yeah, that's even worse. I like it. What are the options here? So this is, oh, this is a belt and this doesn't have a belt, I guess. And it's slightly different. Can change the card and make it Oh yeah, that's great. <laughs> yeah, I think it's time for a for for a makeover here. Uh, and then like, oh yeah, that's good. <laughs> and by good I mean terrible. And then I guess we wear these maybe. Why oh, don't we have more options? No. Oh, we can change the. Car two. Maybe like maybe like a. I think I have to go with something like. I want to match this car kind of. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> and again, by good I mean really bad. <laughs> what a terrible look. <laughs> All right. Uh, back in we go. That's gonna be our look for whatever this is called. I forget again. Gehisen. Which book was it? This one? Garrison. Kadish, Teresa, and then... Ada Kemo. Ada Gira. Okay. What's this book again? Sure. Lots of books. <laughs> what a great look. All right, so that's it for today. Next time we'll we'll tackle a reason for sure, and see if we can make some progress there. We are we're starting ahead. Basically, we already have one of the hands found. We only need six more, which still feels like a lot. Um, I'm still confused. By a few things one of them being there are two more you know spots for pillars here which means two more books which means that we're missing missing one more here and then still missing this one here which i don't know how that makes sense uh i don't know i don't know what these ages are or those it's very confusing to me still everything but yeah let's, let's just roll with the re like the makeover every new age at least for now, we'll see if we get enough clothing to make that interesting. Because we didn't have that many options to begin with. But we're gonna rock this for <laughs> as long as we are in, in Garrison and then you know, we'll change into something a bit, you know, more subdued. Something a little quieter maybe for the next one. But that's it for now, that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.